Hey guys, the Golden Crafter 3 here, and today I have a hidden, uh, somewhat seamless pillar door. Um, I don't know if you guys have seen one or know what it does, but what it does is it creates a 2 by one door right here, and you can just walk straight through the pillar, so let me hit it pretty fast, and that's what it looks like on the back. Now you can make it seamless from the back, but I'm not going to do that, just because it'll make it a little bit bigger, but uh... Here's the redstone over here. It is three by three by four with a volume of 36. And uh, I think that's pretty compact. Uh, there's someone who made a three by three by three, um, but the input's like right here. And that would actually work on mine. It's just, or, well, yeah, the input's right there. But uh, it's, you can't really do anything with it since it's right here. Like you can't extend your walkway out or anything. So I don't really know the use in that, but uh, this is one of the smallest without the input being there that I know of. Um, 36 blocks, and now let's get on to the tutorial of this video. Alright, so first off, what you want to do is have a little th uh, ring around here with stairs. Um, it should look something like this. They don't really have to be curved unless you want it curved. And if you want it curved, all you have to do is just really place it like this and it'll stay curved like that even without the block there um, but your first piston to pull down the stairs will go one block below so it's a sticky piston facing upwards and the second pillar block which will be right here it'll go just right to the left and you'll have two sticky pistons facing upwards and then that'll be the those blocks that you walk across to from Whoops. <laughs> and then this sticky piston here will be to power this piston whatever it's there now we're going to get onto the circuit. So this circuit here is the extension for everything and then half of the retraction. So now all we need to do is have a repeater here on two ticks block and what that'll do is it'll bring this sticky piston down. So then you can all you have to do is just make this piston extend and then you're done. So now what we have to do is put a resonant torch dropper a hopper and then put anything in there it doesn't matter what it is now have a little block set up like this comparator and that's it so as you can see it makes the door open and then you can extend and make your little thing uh oops let me show it from the front so it's sort of easier to see oops so there's the closing, and here's the opening. And yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope this is useful for you guys and your survival worlds. Oh, one more thing. Um, there you can put a quartz block, and here you can swap this and this out and put quartz there. Whoops. And then it's it's not as bad. Like if you have uh, what's different, from, I guess anything other than white down there or quartz or whatever stair block you're using. Um, it's It'll you can somewhat make it look good because since that redstone's there, it makes it all dark. Uh, but on this side, you can have it completely fine. Whoops, man! But you can have it completely quartz, a complete quart block there, or any block. And uh, yeah, uh, so I hope you guys like this. Hope you guys use it in your survival worlds and it's useful. And thank you guys, and I'll see you next time.